Alright, this is Sergio Quinones with MMA Fight Pass. I'm here with Javi Ayala, current uh, belt tour heavyweight. How you doing today, man? You're pretty good, Sergio. Cool, yourself? Man. Good, man. I just saw you guys go through that crazy ass workout, man. That was pretty wild. Um, so, if you don't know Javi, he's been fighting for a while now. Uh, signed with belt tour about how long ago? Like four or five years ago? Yeah, with his first belt tour fight. Uh, been with him ever since. I uh, just came off a huge win that put him on the fucking scene, on blast. Um, tell us about that. Uh, well, this last fight, uh, I went in as a big underdog. You know okay. what I mean, this, this guy, they brought me in for this guy to fuck me up. Yeah. But uh, literally, you know, you know, I've been working my ass off. I've been, I've been training with some tough guys. I've been picking up new skills, and uh, coming over here with one, uh, with uh, crew right here at One Kicks. He actually, uh, he's been working my stand-up a lot, and I feel like my stand-up's gotten a lot better. And, uh, and I, I knew going into this fight that I was the underdog, but me and my whole team knew, like, we, we got this. You know what I mean? This is just another day. What was the guy's name? Uh, Sergi Karen Tonov? Something yeah, like that. I can't, it's hard to pronounce. But. He's a, uh, a Russian prospect. Um, supposed to be probably their next champ that they were thinking, you know, so if that's a little background behind that. Um, Ever since then, um, you were supposed to have a couple fights. I think a, maybe one one of the guys pulled out. Um, yeah, well, they, they've offered me a few fights. And uh, one guy has been hurt, so they were kind of waiting to see how long it would take for him to heal up. But I guess it's, it's taking him a little bit too long. So they, they just, probably about three days ago, they offered me another guy. And uh, now we're kind of just waiting here on a date. Okay. I, can't really, I can't really announce yeah, or say anything, but... Course. There's something working yeah, in the mix. There's something working there's in the There's magic happening. There's magic happening. Um, like you said, like I said, you just came off a huge knockout. I imagine you're going to be getting bigger names, more well-known names, moving up the ranks in heavyweight, man. How does that make you feel, you know, now knowing that, um, you know, because I know I used to watch Bellator fighters, man, these huge name fighters, and now you're moving up there, man. You're going to be well-known. Um, does that change your training uh, routine at all? Are you doing the same thing? Or well, you know what? I, I, well, I've added in one kicks for this last fight, and uh, I, I reap the benefits a lot. Yes. And uh, but my, I always had a real good work ethic. Work ethic. Yeah. So uh, I trained my ass off, you know what I mean? I think it's more the fact that I get super nervous when I fight. Yeah. So I kind of, I don't want this guy to out train me. Yeah. So uh, I go in there prepared. And, uh, and usually I come out victorious, you know what I mean? It's uh, the way I see it's either he, he's getting knocked out or I'm getting knocked out. One of us is going to sleep. Yeah, all right, man. So, um, Abi Ayala, Bellator heavyweight. What are your goals in Bellator, man? Uh, you know, my, my goal right now is to go for that belt. That belt's up in the air. I don't care who I got beat for it. You know what I mean? I'm, I'm going to knock out whoever they put in front of me. All right, man. Um, do you have any thank you shout outs you want to give real fast? You know, first of all, I'd like to thank my wife. You know, she's my biggest supporter. Honestly, without her, I wouldn't, I, would, I probably wouldn't be doing this. Uh, I actually like, I like to thank Crew right here at One Kicks, my cousin Joe Soto at CVCA, all my sponsors that have helped me from the get go, and uh, especially all my training partners. You know, there's, there's a lot of people that don't like getting punched my V, but they do it, so. They stick around and take it, yeah. Um, well, happy all of you guys. Um, thank you. All right, thank you.